Hey everyone, my name is Charlie and today I have a list of five books that you should probably read at Christmas. I've mentioned this book a lot this year. Everybody knows I'm a fan of Charles Dickens. Everybody knows I'm a fan of A Muppet's Christmas Carol. So this book is A Christmas Carol by Charles Dickens. Classic Christmas tale. Great narrative. You should probably go and read it. Also, completely agree with Sam over at Sam's Nonsense because I've mentioned this in another video. Favourite adaptations include Scrooge and A Muppet's Christmas Carol. I was really glad when she said that, because they are the only two adaptations of this book you need in your life. Also, it'll probably make you feel all of those nice, warm, fuzzy feelings that people with souls feel. We have another book that I mention all of the time, and that is The Lollipop Shoes by Joanne Harris. Christmas magic and chocolate. What more could you want in a book? Also France. 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 Home of the thin people where they should all be fat. Seriously. I went on a French diet, now look at me. Next, we have another book that I'm not sure whether I've mentioned before, but I'm mentioning it now. That book is Dash and Lily's Book of Dares by Rachel Cohn and David Leverton. This book has books and two teenagers meeting and a love story, and I don't usually care for that sort of thing. But these two meet and there's books. I probably cared more about the books than Christmas, but it's great. Very fast read. If you need something to just fill up that Goodreads goal, read this. Next, we have another book. Everybody will put this on the list for Christmas. Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone, or Sorcerer's Stone to you strange folk in America. This is a good book. There's a guy, he's a wizard, he has a poor life, and then like Oliver Twist, he grows up and everything's okay. Kind of. This guy still wants to kill him though. He's being chased by a murderer. He has some magic. No one thought to put this murderer down earlier, like. Oh, strongest sorcerer in the century. No, man. Seriously. You have magic. Kill the bitch. This next book, also mentioned before, it's The Snow Child by Eowyn Ivy. She's named after someone out of The Lord of the Rings. These two people, a uh, man, wife, live in Alaska. Very mean there, very cold. People don't really tend to like it, especially in fiction. Cold, barren, wilderness. This couple, you know, because the baron is meant to represent the mother. She's barren, so... They build a child out of snow, child comes to life, and then they, it follows their lives, they're very happy, and then it ends sadly. Great book to read at Christmas if you want your heart broken. And my apologies if there are any spoilers for those books. I hope you enjoyed this video, and until next time, that is all.